All right, we're in here with the uh, lots three and four, be a Red Barrow and a Red Gilt out of the 115 litter, uh, uh, sired by Red Eye, the Tallman Boar. We partnered with uh, Trace Amigos there, and first crop is is sure doing what we expected him to do and bringing some power and muscle to the table. Uh, out of a Jurassic impeccable sow, out of an incredibly good sow line we've had great success with. We've sold some litter mates, uh, 115s there last week, and we've uh, kept three back uh, that we're offering now that weren't quite ready, a little bit smaller, but uh, sure have caught up and, and looked the part. So we're going to start off with the uh, 115.4, four would be lot three. That's the dark male pig in the pen now. And, and this bear here is one that uh, we think is pretty darn good. And he was just a little bit smaller, so we didn't put him in the last sale, but we think this one's got a really bright future. Uh, extremely dark in his color, but you get past that, I think proportions are good in terms of his length of body and frame size. Uh, Monster-legged and heavy structured. Uh, he's got a big uh, big foot working in him. and still stout skulled. Comes and goes with some width and power, and I think one that's going to be fun to feed and one you could show early but still last into that uh, July setting, I don't think, without any issue at all. Uh, still mobile enough on his feet and legs, and we think one that's uh, going to be easy feeding and, and fun to show uh, uh, all times of spring and summer. Uh, going to be a good bear there on down the way. We like a great deal. Power and muscle, and, and one that I think uh, pu pulls himself together awfully, awfully good. The 115.5 gilt is uh, is one that uh, we've had our eye on for a good while, and we, we like this gilt uh, a great deal. And we sold a couple litter mates there. Uh, uh, there in our last sale, and this one here just stacks right up. I mean, uh, sound, flexible, she's square coming and going, proportions are good, offers that shape and muscle up high, but still comes and goes with the right amount of width, and everything kind of just is very proportional, but still one you're not going to have to wait on in terms of muscle. Hind leg's awesome in terms of flexibility, uh, and as I said, I think her shape matches, her body shape's really good, and, and one that's, uh, you know, big enough in her type and kind, but not a giant and, and not a moderate little boxy one. We just think every things just uh, kind of in place and looks like the easy feeding kind of a guilt that's going to be fun to jackpot and still last uh, easily into that July setting and, and not get uh, too out of bounds in terms of her, of her overall just uh, uh, dimension and frame but I think a really good guilt with a bright future out of that uh, 115 litter.